An iconic Burlington building is due for a makeover. Our Laura Ullman was at an open house where, they, where the mayor asked her constituents, what is the future you envision for Memorial Auditorium? How do we do this engagement process in an exciting way? One that gets you into a creative mindset. One that honors the legacy of this block and listens to your stories at the same time. Built to honor World War I veterans, Memorial Auditorium has been a daycare center, concert venue, sports arena, farmer's market, art studio, and more in its 88 years. But in 2016, it proved to be too dangerous to rally in and was closed. You can do anything in that auditorium to generate whatever it is they're trying to generate. It's infinite. It's infinite. You get it? Infinite. For a space that will be both private and public, its options are, as Joseph Mandel says, infinite. So the city and the developers spearheading the project are asking Burlington, what should it be? The Fletcher Free Library was packed with several dozen Burlingtonians from all walks of life and experiences with Memorial. They put stickers up to vote on what kind of public space they wanted to see. Conference and trade hall, concert venue and farmer's market were most popular. But there were some creative write-ins, like a food hall or a semi-pro sports team stadium. I think we have to keep an open mind of what that building is and the condition it's in and, um, you know, to, to be respectful of its history and to think about what it can be going forward. Historical advocates want to keep the facade. Co-developers Joe Larkin and Eric Farrell say they're not sure if building within the existing structure or demolishing it would be more expensive. Joseph Mandel says he doesn't care if it's leveled. He just wants the heart of the structure to stay a memorial to our veterans. Their grandchildren are still alive, and their great-grandchildren are still alive. Now, it may not mean much to them, but it means something to someone. If you didn't get to make it out to the open house at Memorial Auditorium, the Community and Economic Development Office of the City of Burlington is asking you to leave a comment. You can find a link to that option on our website at WCAX.com. Reporting in Burlington, I'm Laura Ullman, Channel 3 News.